Welcome back, heroes. It is now Wednesday. Well, sunny, but nesting and resting today for the Rams. The moon actually moved into Cancer last night at the end of the day. That puts emotional focus now on survival, and that's what Cancer is all about anyways. We just spent 30 days with the sun in Cancer. Boy, did I not like that. Well, today we're returning emotionally to where we were in the last 30 days, so hopefully you're okay in that sector. This is a great day really to invest in your survival, whether it's brushing your teeth or doing a little gardening. If you have to go to work today, which most of us do, I'm at work too, then well, you might find that you're kind of tired, you have lower energy, because really what you need to do is recharge your emotional batteries in the next 24 hours or so. One last thing, you'll find that you're extra sensitive when it comes to your emotions around home, family, and survival. Now, zipping around the zodiac, we are in chapter one of Sun and Leo. Today, the sun is at seven degrees, and Venus, which is up ahead, is showing some breakthrough. Let's start with the sun. Neptune is technically the ruling planet of the day. So when Neptune rules a day, we all get kind of logged into the universe, what I call the soul collective up there. We all have a board of spirits that serves us. They're earth walkers. There's all kinds of terms for this. But there are souls up there that do nothing but try to whisper things in our ear. And every now and then, Neptune takes over and kind of logs us in. So if you're a person that does not meditate whatsoever, I recommend you take a nice long nap today. Let it come through your dream life and pay attention to what your friends say around you and the people say around you. Sometimes the universe will send a message through a friend and we're kind of closed off to our own intuition. Lastly, looks like there may be a bit of a breakthrough when it comes to a creative or romantic project in the next 24 hours. Look for that breakthrough. It's an opportunity. All right, Harold, that's all I have for Wednesday. We're two days away from Lightcast Day. See you tomorrow and live, love, be.